Hi. So in this video, we are going to learn how to prove the formula for a plus b plus c whole square using geometry. So as you can see, I have already drawn a square whose one side is equal to a plus b plus c. And you can see the markings also. You can see I have marked the length a till here, after that b and after that c. And vertically also I have marked length equal to a, then equal to b and then equal to c. And yes, now I'm going to draw vertical lines from this point and this point and two horizontal lines from this point and this point. And it is going to divide this whole square into nine parts. Yeah, of course, those nine parts are not going to be equal. What they are going to be? Let's see. So I have drawn the lines and now this square has got divided into nine parts. Out of which we have this is a square whose one side is equal to a. Since it's one side is equal to a, so its area will be a square. Then we have one more square. The length of the side of this square is b. So the area of this square will be b square. And then we have one more square whose side is equal to c. So the area of this square will be c square. And after this we have total six rectangles, but they can be divided into three different types. This rectangle and this rectangle have similar dimensions whose length is equal to a and width is equal to b. So the area of these rectangles will be a, b. And after that we have these two rectangles which have same area where the length is equal to a and breadth is equal to c. So the area will be c, a and c, a. And after that we have these two black rectangles and each of them have length equal to c and breadth equal to b. So the area will be bc for each of them. So now what can we say about the area of the bigger square? The bigger square has one side equal to a plus b plus c. So its area will be a plus b plus c whole square. This can also be written as the sum of all these individual areas, right? So this can be written as a square the area of this square plus b square, the area of this square plus c square, the area of this yellow square plus 2 times ab plus 2 times bc plus 2 times ca. So yeah, it's just for fun. We have derived this formula using geometry. So keep watching MathSmart and bye-bye till then.